Hey, I'm K1. What's up? So today, I'm gonna make a video that I was supposed to make ages ago because Jim Chapman made a video called the 10 Little Questions Tag where he made up this tag to where he answered, which is, says the name 10 Little Questions. But yeah, I was supposed to make them, but then so many videos I had made, I had kind of a schedule of what I was gonna upload. And so today, I decided to make it. First question is What YouTuber do you secretly have a crush on? Well, there's two, but I can't really decide between the two of them. One is Grace Helbig, because she is funny, hot, I just love her the bits, and if I ever meet her, I will hopefully become friends with her, because I just love her the bits. And number two is Zoella, because, or Zoe Sog, because she is so amazing. So whenever I see her videos, she, uh, like in her vlogs, she makes me laugh so much. But since she's with Alfie, and I love him too because he is so awesome, so uh, I'm going to say Chris help me because she's not with anyone that I know of, and she's hot. Number two, if you had a terrorist like a Doctor Who, what would you do with it? Well, if you haven't heard of a terrorist, and if you haven't watched Doctor Who, which I don't know how you haven't because it's on TV for years now, but anyway, uh, Doctor Who is about, um, the, 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 about this time lord who goes through time in the, in the TARDIS, which is the question. Uh, you can travel any time, any place, whatever, whatever time you like, if you don't have the Doctor's TARDIS, that is. I have three things I would do. One, I would go back in time and become an archer, back in the medieval time, because I've always wanted to learn archery back then, because I've always wanted to be an archer. Because I just love archery so much, it looks so awesome! Like in Lord of the Rings and Game of Thrones, it's just so cool. Then number two, I would go to the future and see how we develop, to, if we're even on this planet or if we're even alive, and see if there's a, how far we've gone in gaming and see hopefully there being a virtual reality. And number three, I would go back in time, become an actor back in time, and act in movies that I've always loved and, and change my name so I don't recognise myself back in. When I'm younger, and then when I do see him now, I'm like, oh my god, that's me! So if, if I ever see my name that I've thought of, then I actually have succeeded in getting a time machine and going back in time and doing it. Number three, what's what the secret that nobody else knows? Well, that's kind of hard because here I have a friend that has that knows all my secrets. I can't really say that I have a secret that nobody that not everyone knows, but I'm excluding him. So one secret that nobody knows is that. I have, since I was like 16, I have loved the Disney Channel and Nickelodeon programs and I can't get enough of them. Even though I'm 20 years old and I should be watching shows like, I don't know, some serious shows, I love Nickelodeon shows and Disney Channel shows. Like Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, that may be old but I love that show so much. And Sam and Cat and Victorious and so many of those shows, I love them. What did you dream last night? Uh, Eight hours later. Uh, I don't remember. Dragons or something, I don't know. I was watching Game of Thrones, so I can't really remember. If you could be any character from any movie, who would it be? I would want to be Tony Stark, because who wants to, who wouldn't want to be Tony Stark? You're a billionaire, philanthropist, playboy, all the awesome stuff. And gosh, Iron Man, Susan, you've got, you're working with the Avengers and you're in the Iron Man of the Universe. What else would you want? You've got a suit that shoots repulsor beams. And it's just totally awesome. What are you excited for? Well, what I'm excited for is, well, def definitely summer. Because, because one, I'm finishing college. Two, I'm going to Portugal with my friend. And it's going to be awesome. Because I'm going to be vlogging and stuff. I'm going to be creating nautical videos. Uh, and also, Summer in the City is coming up in August, so and this is my first time, so I'm definitely gonna be enjoying it. Hopefully, I'll be doing some more some videos with some YouTubers there. So, because uh, I, I would really want to meet more YouTubers in Britain as well. And also, there's also an Irish YouTuber event that's coming up in July, I think. But yeah, I, when it gets closer to the day, I'll be talking about it more often. And also, my graduation. Can't forget that. <laughs> Also, finishing college means I can get into more acting auditions because uh, I don't have the college work to do anymore, and so I'll be between college and getting a job, so I can start going for more auditions and 
hopefully get in them in animated movies. If you ruled the world, what would the first thing you would do? I don't know, there's so many things I would do. But I, I think that... Uh, I would try and end world hunger. Uh, I would get uh, give money to try and save all stray animals all over the world. Because I am a love for animals and I just hate to see strays. Modernize technology and do all this type of stuff like that. Like, make a machine that kind of... That would be able to control the weather all over the world and say whichever weather each country wants to have, you'd be able to do it. Or they say it in a beauty patch that would be harsher punishments. And world peace. Sing the last song that was stuck in your head. Since, since a while ago, I was listening to the Frozen soundtrack because I love it so much. It's got to be Do You Want to Build a Snowman? Elsa? Do you want to build a snowman? Come on, let's go and play. I never see you anymore. Come out the door, it's like you've gone away. We used to be best buddies, and now we're not. I wish you would tell me why. Do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Okay, bye. I, I'm really trying to train my voice better. Beatbox. Yeah, I'm terrible. Don't, don't touch me. The last question is, what, what would you like to achieve in the future? Well, there's so many. I want to become an actor in the future because it would be just so awesome. And also, I ho I'm hoping to move to London very, like maybe next year to like do get get some money for like and get into an acting academy. And I hope that I'll be making a lot more. I'll be making YouTube videos with some British YouTubers. Oh, here's the hope. I would just love to go move to London and do, do videos with uh, British YouTubers because it'd just be so much fun. And I also want to do a lot more collaborations with people, with a lot more YouTubers. And that, that's, that's it. I, 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 out of all of those questions, I think the most cringing one was the beatboxing. You should know, you have to listen to me doing it. If anybody, want, anybody watching this video wants to make it, wants to do this tag, then go ahead and do it. I tag you all watching. Since I have, don't really know that many YouTubers personally, I tag Craig McHugh if you're watching, aka Tripolar Cry, if I'm saying that right, um, John Cleary, and Declan DeVito. Go. Do it. Do you feel lucky? <laughs> Bye. If you didn't get all the questions that in that video, I'll leave them down below and I'll also leave the link to Jacob's video down below too.